everywhere. As variants of COVID-19 continue to emerge, a new Canadian research suggests that a pharmaceutical form of CBD or synthetic cannabis oil could offer protection against COVID-19. CBD was encouraging the cells to respond to a virus the way you would hope that they would. Lead investigator Dr. Robin Duncan says the study shows that CBD increases the cell's response to several key proteins produced by SARS-CoV-2, the virus that causes COVID-19. The effect was unknown before their study. Well, when we put CBD in at, at, a, at a pharmacological dose, what we saw was this much better activation. It just kind of soared. Top system got activated and the cells started dying and they were doing what they were supposed to do when they see viral genes. CBD is found in the cannabis plant, but it's not intoxicating. The second thing that was exciting was the fact that when we put CBD into our, our healthy cells, our control cells that didn't have any virus present, the cells weren't dying. It's just as though um, the cells turned on their home security systems. The health experts that I spoke to say the focus here is on medicinal cannabis rather than the recreational cannabis that people can access in stores. Cannabis has a lot to offer in this fight against COVID. University of Lethbridge professor Dr. Olga Kowalczuk is also studying the effects of medical cannabis on COVID-19. You know, when we say medicinal cannabis, the other thing we also mean is that we are looking for cannabis that has specific anti-cancer, anti-inflammatory, antiviral properties grown, cultivated in uh, you know, strictly controlled conditions. Duncan's study, which has been pre-peer reviewed, is currently under review in the Journal of Life Sciences. Hopes are to move the research toward clinical trials. To test directly to see whether or not giving CBD um, ahead of a viral challenge can help protect mice. And that preclinical data is going to be really important. The only thing that is needed right now is a proper large-scale trial. Health experts urging people to stay with things that we know they work, including vaccines. In Edmonton, Hibba Kamal, Shufi, City News.